Hello everyone, welcome back to another video and today is a review video but it's a Camp Cretaceous team team here we have Pierce the Cantrosaurus here here Pierce Oranosaurus Ceratosaurus and then the new Nothosaurus here so let's do it okay first let's open the Nothosaurus Nothosaurus okay I thought it, it would be smaller. <laughs> here. Okay, so here we have the Nothosaurus outside of the box. Here, let's look at the box first. It's uh, it's part of the Dino Tracker line, and here we have the Australopithecus, Baby Brachiosaurus, Nothosaurus, and then Elap Elaphrosaurus, Laprosaurus, something like that. And here on the box, you can see Blue and Beta. Now the Nothosaurus. The Nothosaurus is based on the one that appears in Camp Cretaceous in terms of body because of coloration. It doesn't look like that. The one in the show is kind of like blue. Yeah, it's light blue with some dark blue. And you have the scan code here. The arms are all articulated. Also the neck. And the mouth. And also the tail. Pretty good scope. Oh, mine has like these paint errors here of the feet, teeth. Here it's look like kind of normal, and then here. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't do much. So let's go for size comparison. Here we have Dr. Alan Grant, a Trusteraptor Red, and then the Triceratops. Here. Okay, there. Here we have the Oranosaurus, also from Cambridaceous. This Oranosaurus from 2021, I think. Here, here. This one they had they put the scan code on the feet, which is way better than what we have now. Also, like the Nothosaurus, the Oranosaurus here is the body is based on Camp Cretaceous, but the colorations aren't. And different than the Nothosaurus, the Oranosaurus has like sound features. That's why he has this big button here. A lot of people don't like this figure because of the button here. I don't mind. You're the run away. The Ranosaurus doesn't have a mouth articulated. I think I think only like the big, really big herbivores have mouth articulation like the brachial, apatosaurus, the main shoes, renatus, terzino. Yeah. I think only them. At least on the like this line of Mattel. The, the Hammond collection, the, the really good ones, they they have a better articulation. Except the first strike. Now for the size comparison we have Alan Grant, Trustoraptor Red, and then the Triceratops. Here's the size of the Aronosaurus. 
Okay, now we have here the Cantrasaurus. This one is based on Pierce, the Cantrasaurus from the Camp Protection Show. <laughs> Different than the Oranosaurus and the Nathosaurus, this one has the right colors of the, the show. Unfortunately, the tail is not painted, oh, and it's part of the body too. Here. Oh yeah, you have the legs articulated. And the head. And here is the button, which does. All the sounds are stegosaurus sounds, not cantrosaurus. Charlotte Red and then the Triceratops. Here is the yeah, here size of the control. Now, for the last time, so we have the Ceratosaurus. In Campertations, we have two colors of Cerato. We have a gray one and a red one that is like the JP3 one, which is this one. Here the tail is articulated. The legs, the arms. Different than the Cantrell, it doesn't have any paint here on the... This part of the bar, I forgot what would be the name. <laughs> but because it doesn't have anything here, it doesn't feel like a problem. Like, for example, the Cantrell, you, it's weird because we have only on this part of the body, nothing on the rest. But then on the Serato, it doesn't feel weird. And also like the Cantrell. No, I think only the Aranosaurus has the button like on the on the other side of the body because of the sail. Yeah. Here. Size comparison, and Grant, and Grant, Red, and the Trike. Here. For size. Here. Okay. So, thank you guys all for watching, and I see you all on the next video. Bye.